tell the prime minister i want to do a two hour with him one of these days we want to let him prime minister remember tell me no students tell the prime minister of jamaica that this audience over here want to i will want to face him The assault on our democracy is the dead babies them. We can't get the ventilators and we don't know where the ventilators are. You know what is an assault on our democracy? When we cannot graduate more than 7,000, 6,500 out of 35,000 people yearly with five or more subjects. You know what is an assault on our democracy? No hospital beds in the hospitals. You know what is an assault on our democracy? The several bad roads and bad waters that we're getting in Discover. You know what is an assault on our democracy? The preferential treatment that, fa that people get in, in the agricultural process where the farm workers can get paid for them goods how much months upon months you know you know what is an assault on our democracy and assault on our democracy is when your law enforcers your police and your soldier them take on an assault the poor people them in this country you know what is an assault on our democracy the state of public emergency you know what is an assault on our democracy when six illicit thieves sit down in the parliament and we can, you know what is an assault on our democracy when you can declare your assets for three years and you're sitting the prime minister's chair making making you know what is an assault on this democracy the people them are try who are marooned and can't get a bridge that is the assault on our democracy the assault on our democracy is when you name your wife speaker of the house for hush up things under the carpet that is an assault on our desert you know what is an assault on our democracy the amount of millions the banks stiffing out in the people them and nothing is being done no legislation is put in place to deal with banking fees in this country that is an assault on democracy that's what i'm saying to you tonight that is an assault on our democracy when you put when you when you when you when you when you, when you, when you, when you put belt you know what an assault when you have paula Llewellyn still have fight to become dpp in this country that's an assault on our democracy That is what an assault of a democracy is. An assault of a democracy is when you're trying to silence social media. An assault on our democracy is when you put a gag order on the Integrity Commission. An assault on our democracy is when your government has decided that they are going to what? Keep the sex offenders registry silent. That is an assault on our democracy. When young babies and children are being raped and ravished in this country. That is assault on our democracy. You know, like when people talk the truth. When we have the highest femicide rate in the world. That is an assault on our democracy. When 10,000 people have died under your watch as prime minister of this country that is an assault on our democracy through homicide you don't like when people tell you the truth people don't know how to tell you the truth but are looking in your face and tell you you promised this country that under your watch we'll be able to open the windows and doors we have to lock up like we in chicken cob that's an assault on our democracy you have failed to keep the promises. Under the assault of our democracy, you spoke about impeachment. Where is the impeachment bill? Under the assault of the democracy, you spoke, Prime Minister Holness, about what? Two terms government, two term prime ministers. That is an assault of our democracy. An assault on our democracy is when you promise Jamaican I. And Jamaica, I not working to catch the criminals. Jamaican eyes always hacked. 
You know, I talk about Jamaica and the democracy. The, the assault on our democracy is when so much cyber attacks happening in the different agencies. I assault on our democracy is when they're thief in people's land and I go on a friend for below apartments. That's an assault on our democracy. You know, like hear the truth. So now they need to look you in the eyes and tell you the goddamn truth of what is happening, which is an assault on our democracy. And the greatest assault on our democracy is you, Andrew Michael Holness, a treacherous, treasonous prime minister to the country. The assault on our democracy, the greatest one is when you and your government could take 300% and 200% increases. And the civil society workers in this country must take 20% 20 increase. That is an insult on our democracy. You don't like talk about that. But because, talk about the 200% increase, that is the greatest slap in the face of humanity and the people are hardworking people of this country. They might, they might forget, but I have not forgotten because I stood in sun day and night remembering the people and reminding the people of this country what you did. Biggest democ salty democracy. No CT scan, no MRI machine, no ECG, no dialysis machine. And coupled with that, Jamaica, coupled with that, what we don't have, no ambulances. That is a no oxygen. You remember, these people can't breathe. No ventilators. That's an assault on our democracy. So when you talk and when you look and telling people about you're going to crack down on the assault of democracy, look in yourself, go in the mirror and say, Have I done any justice to the people of Jamaica? Take yourself out of the green and walk around. Put on one little pulley and just walk around Jamaica. Walk around Jamaica without security. Put on something and hide yourself and walk through the, the roads of Kingston and St. Andrew. Walk downtown. Walk through River Valley. Walk through Rima. Walk through the Valley. Walk through Anne Gardens. Walk through West Kingston. And you will see the realities of how poor people and children in this country are suffering. No nurses at hospital, no doctors at hospital. Are you going to talk about crackdown and this and that? Talk, walk through the place them. Just as Christ walked through the synagogue and mash it up. Walk through and you will see for yourself. You will see for yourself. You know, much hungry belly picnic I go to school a man in time. And when the, the when the hunger catch them, you think them can't eat nothing. You think them can't do no school work. Left your security gear and walk through. And look at your legacy. Walk through without security. Go through the place them and you see your legacy, man. Look how people have your teeth light. Look how people have your touch water. Go look on the pitch latrine them. And then when you do, ask yourself, walk through. Left the labor right and the wall in the entourage and walk through the situation in a West Milan. In a Hanover. Walk through the hospital, a, a Black River hospital. Walk through Savlamar. Go down a Cornwall Regional for yourself. Go in the prison them. Go in the jail cell them. Walk through on your own. And you will see the reality of poor people in this country. When you see that, ask yourself if you are not the greatest threat to the democracy of this country.